It's Friday, February 7th, 2014. I'm Adrian Jeffries, and I apologize if I'm a little bit off today. I just got these screws put in my neck, and I think one of them is loose. This is 90 Seconds on the Verge. The Winter Olympics kicked off today in Sochi with the spectacular opening ceremony. But just like the events leading up to the games, things did not go quite as planned. Instead of the five iconic Olympic rings, viewers saw four rings and what looked like an asterisk when the top right ring failed to expand. While that may be a glaring mistake in the ceremony, the full show was apparently quite impressive. You can watch for yourself when the ceremony airs tonight on NBC. GoPro is going public. The extreme sports camera maker announced it's filed a confidential IPO. The company has been expanding its brand, adding its own editing software and original content to its name, but now it seems GoPro wants to be a media company. The confidential IPO process allows the company to keep financial details private until a few weeks before their shares begin public trading. GoPro was valued at around $2.5 billion in December of 2012, so the IPO would be expected to value the company at several times that figure. And finally, the upcoming fourth film in the Jurassic Park series will be filmed in a surprisingly prehistoric way. Despite more and more films opting to film digitally, Jurassic World will be shot on film. This move means the sequel will visually match the three earlier Jurassic Park films and not go all George Lucas on us. Jurassic World, which stars Parks and Recreation's Chris Pratt, is set to be released on June 12, 2015. That's it for today's top stories. Coming up tomorrow, I get this neck issue figured out. Oh no, here it goes again! Ah!